Hi, and welcome to this introduction to the tracking and planning features of IBM Rational Team Concert. Rational Team Concert is a complete tooling environment for task, change, and source code management that deals with some of the most typical challenges, like planning across distributed teams, wasted time in meetings, little or no dependency management, lack of visibility into progress and status, no insight into process and planning improvements, changing requirements that require plan adjustments, problems discovered too late, and delivery delays. Rational Team Concert does this by helping you stay focused on simple built-in collaboration in the context of the work you do, which really just means that if you use Rational Team Concert to do your work, you are automatically collaborating. Having the visibility into status and progress of teams so that managers don't have to bug the people doing the real work. Information is live and available at a glance. Imagine no more spreadsheets. Helping you not only identify dependencies, but also track them and mitigate any risks that cause delays. And last but not least, insight that shows you how well you're doing and where you might need to improve. And if you get stuck, Rational Team Concert builds in guidance to help you learn a new process or understand what you need to do next. Let's take a quick look. We're looking here at a Rational Team Concert dashboard, which you can think of as a landing page for all members working on a team, like one-stop shopping where they can get all information relevant to planning and delivering changes in the scope of a team. And everything you see here can be tailored to have the content that your organization cares about. Notice the tabs that are across the top of the dashboard. Tabs are a way that you can organize content and direct team members and stakeholders to specific areas of information suitable for them. And you see these colorful widgets? These are actually reports that are created using Jazz Reporting Service. That's a built-in feature of Rational Team Concert. These are really nifty because they provide an at-a-glance view of information, but you can easily change to the table view to drill into the de details. And Rich Hover is enabled, so that allows you to look at some details about aspects of the report without ever leaving your dashboard. The content that Rational Team Concert manages under the covers, which is surfaced in the widgets on this dashboard, are focused around what we call work items. There are a number of different work item types to help you define, plan, and manage work, and this is fully customizable. Teams collaborate through work items too, so let's take a quick look. The story work item is typical of work items in Rational Team Concert that have system attributes like the summary, the owner, the iteration that the work item is planned for. There are tabs along the top so that you can do things like specify acceptance criteria and done criteria, look at links to other artifacts, um, manage approvals and approval history, and also look at the complete history that comprises an audit trail for, for a set of changes that are encapsulated in a work item. On the overview tab, this is where collaboration happens in the discussion section. You can use the at mention kind of technology, which allows you to direct comments to a specific person or a set of people. But everyone that has permission to view a work item can see the discussion and the discussion history is preserved in the work item. Once work items are defined, you plan work by using plans that contain work items in a specified scope, like a sprint or a set of sprints. There are two different ways to plan. Traditional planning, which is suitable for product managers and others that need a bird's eye view of work in flight, and quick planner, which is optimized for quick and simple team-based planning. We're gonna take a look at each of these. The roadmap plan provides us with a tree view of features and stories, essentially the work breakdown. We can expand the twisties and see that work breakdown. We can also get quick visualization of other attributes for all of these work items. We can also uh, use the quick expand button and actually expand the work the work breakdown across the entire roadmap plan. That's pretty nifty. Now, if you're a team doing sprint planning, quick planner is the thing for you. Just like plan views in traditional planning, Quick Planner is another way of looking at the data. There are different kinds of boards. A sprint planning board, for example, is very typical for a team that's leading a daily scrum meeting where they're viewing incoming work, managing and grooming their backlog, and planning for the next iteration or the next sprint. The Quick Planner boards provide drag and drop. They provide easy child uh, task breakdown, as you can see here. So a very simple way of doing team-based planning. So that's just a quick overview of the tracking and planning capabilities. So what other kind of capabilities are available? 
Well, I am glad you asked. Process definition and enforcement for one thing. You choose whether you're looking to support agile scrum teams or an entire agile enterprise. Rational Team Concert can do that. Or maybe you still need to conform to traditional methods. No big deal. You can even mix these in a hybrid environment or build your own. And then there is source code management. Next to tracking and planning, this is the other key feature of Rational Team Concert. It includes managing change in distributed environments, so things like parallel development with conflict resolution built in, or support for code reviews, or automated build and automated test capabilities. And for regulatory compliance, Rational Team Concert maintains a complete audit trail so that you can be ready to respond to an audit request in hours instead of weeks. You can learn more about Rational Team Concert by going through the material on this page. Then be sure to explore Rational Team Concert in our demo environment to get some hands-on experience for yourself. Thanks for taking the time to watch.